President Biden will be signing the next COVID relief package on Friday, which was approved by Congress earlier today. Now, this bill includes $1,400 payments for individuals that are earning $75,000 annually and couples up to $150,000. Checks would end for individuals making more than $80,000 a year and couples earning $160,000. Anyone who falls in between those two figures would get a partial amount. Now, this relief bill also includes direct aid to local counties, cities, towns, and villages, which is, of course, welcome news for Western New York communities who are still struggling financially because of this long pandemic. Channel 2's Leanne Stuck has more. Uh, this $1.9 trillion rescue plan, it's the largest single investment, the most progressive uh, uh, rescue bill in the history of the country. The American Rescue Plan is expected to be signed into law on Friday by President Joe Biden. With it comes millions of dollars for local municipalities. Erie and Niagara counties will receive nearly $775 million in direct aid. Well, you know, I started, I was in, I was in office for two and a half months and this happened. And so let me just say that this is probably the best news um, within City Hall, the City Hall business this is the best news I've had since I've gotten here. The City of Niagara Falls is receiving $59.5 million. Mayor Robert Restaino said he's still working to determine how that money will be spent, but said several million will be used to address the budget deficit. The City of Buffalo will receive $350 million, while Erie County will collect $178 million. I asked Congressman Higgins why that's the case. Well, the distribution is based on the community development block grant formula and the city uh, by as a percentage of its population has uh, a poorer uh, segment of its population uh, than the county of Erie. <clears throat> that said, uh, this is a record amount of funding uh, for both uh, the county of Erie and the city of Buffalo. Under the new stimulus plan, Chautauqua County will receive $24.6 million. We're going to sit back in. You really look at that money, basically, you know, put it in our general fund or, you know, market right now and then uh, look at, you know, what we are going to do in the future with that. And even Lancaster is set to receive $4.7 million, which the village mayor says he's still trying to figure out where that money will go. We want to make sure that we replenish any of the things that we need to do and then look at uh, see what some of this funding may be used, able to be used for in the future. Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.